Okay, sorry, I was jamming out. That was pretty cool. But, hi everyone, this is GamerCat09. Welcome back to Deadly Premonition 2. We are continuing on with uh, the Lord Hungers mission. So we have to get a can of spam at Melvin's crawfish van, which hopefully is still outside the sheriff department. So we're going to head there and hope for the best. Please be here. Oh, I was gonna say, it's not here, but it is. Okay. Okay. I... I was gonna say, I don't care if I'm sunburned. Okay, hold on! Let us buy a can of Spam. Okay. Do we need anything else while we're here? $15 for a first aid kit. That's a ripoff. Some root beer. Ooh, cookie. Fills your stomach a tiny bit. Hot dog. Suntan lotion. Uh, you know what? Let's try it. Healing fragrant, fra fragrance, fragrance, sleeping bag. Clean yourself up a little bit. This one hides your bo, but it's like thirty-eight dollars. Anti numb. Okay. Mister York, spam, huh? You a pot of meat kind of guy? Actually, I find spam gross. No, Melvin, I've simply gotten myself tangled up in a little mess. Oh, I get it, Mr. York. The Lord hungers! Right. Why is it always Echo? <laughs> yes, apparently the Lord is starving, and I'm a lamb with no sense of direction. Don't you hate it when that happens? Alright. One done. So, now we have two left. Um. Alexis Diner. We gotta go get beans? So, onward. Man, it's so easy with the fast transportation. My god. Not that I have any hatred towards the skateboard, but it takes forever. Whereas this just gets you there in like 30 seconds. Okay. Onward. Oh yeah, and there's always that then there's also that side quest I never got. <laughs> well maybe I could continue that, because I think I got the one ingredient that I never got back here to finish. So I can at least give her that ingredient. I don't remember. Um I might have to look it up. Okay. The air out there don't feel right today. You feel it too, honey? Yep. Um, so let's talk. Oh, Ma, where's the third ingredient? I'm just about done preparing the first two. At this rate, they're gonna go bad before you bring me the third one. Hustle up and go get me that last ingredient, honey. Okay, so I have to order something <laughs> from her. Oh, coming right up, honey. I'll put my heart and soul into it. Okay. Beans? Do you have beans? How do I get beans from you? Oh, shit. I can only do it on Mondays. What day is it? Alexis, could I have some red beans and rice? Oh, my lord. Sorry, honey, but no can do. We only serve red beans and rice on Monday. Fuck. That's a meal you eat when you're busy. Like folks usually are on Monday. It's been a tradition here in Louisiana for as long as I can remember. Wait, honey, don't tell me. You're the type who does your laundry every day? Hell no, only Sundays. <laughs> oh. 
tradition, Zach. This is it. The Deep South. Louisiana. We need to obey tradition here and come back on Monday. But the Lord hungers. What day is it? What what day is it? It's Wednesday! I gotta wait like five days? Are you kidding me? Oh my god. Alright, well I guess we have to complete some other shit before we can do this on Monday. Wow. So... I can't even complete the main story. Oh my god. Um... Well... The third ingredient, let's look that up because... Uh, we have to do, oh god, it's like a side quest and a side quest and a side quest. The only reason I'm looking it up is because the side quests are really freaking bad. So let's, um, get, get, oh. Go back. I get a side quest from Avery. Huh. Which I don't think I have. Okay, so let's check to make sure I don't have it. I could look up Danny's Lost Treasure. I could do the... The elusive water valve. I need to get time. But I don't... Hmm. So in order to complete the side quest for the food, the, um, whatchamacallit, the chef of tradition, I need to get a side quest from Avery, the tall man from the the food, uh, frozen food place. But I can only speak to him in the afternoon, and since it is 11.30 on a Wednesday, um, I think we might be in a better standing to go back to Casa Pineapple. Between... I have to hear something from the chef. So I think the chef is available from 11 to 13.30. So I think we're going to go back there since I'm kind of at a halt right now with all of my side quests and stuff. So we're just going to go right there. Even though it's right down the road, I don't care. <laughs> we're just going to do it. Alright, let's hope I can talk to him. I'll be very sad if I can't. Okay. Alright, so the bellboy's not here. Concierge isn't here. So that's gotta mean that the chef's upstairs. Um, let's try. Chef? Yes. Gonna be another hot one today. Talk. Hey, mister, how do you like our shower pressure? Just what the doctor ordered, ain't it? It appears that the shower in my room is broken. So there's currently no way for me to sample the water pressure that you seem to be so proud of. Hmm, is that so? I'm a chef, so anything other than foods outside my jurisdiction. You're a true pro, after all. But, I may be able to give you a hint that'll help you fix this problem of yours. Meaning, might be something's wrong with the water valve near the bathroom on the first floor. That damn bellboy's supposed to be checking up on it, but he never follows through. I see, well then, can you have him fix the valve? No can do, Mr. FBI. 
I'm a pro chef, which means I ain't gonna do jack squat outside of go cooking good, genuine food. Then what should I do? You're an FBI agent, ain't you? Fixing up a valve should be a piece of cake to a fella like you. Zack, it looks like we'll need to masquerade as plumbers for a bit if we wish to enjoy a good shower here. Yeah, it's been like three days since I've showered. So, I, I should probably shower. At least that's what I'm guessing. I don't know when he showered before coming here. So, we're probably just gonna do that. So, we have to go to the bathroom downstairs. Let's see. Oh, you know what? I It just dawned on me. Remember how I was in the bathroom here before? And you see, like, all of these... Like, under here, there was, like, a bunch of, like, clothes and stuff on the floor. I bet you this is where Chef David changes all of his shit to be, like, each person. Okay. So many valves, but so what? It shouldn't matter if I loosen them all at once. Besides, I'm not a plumber, so it's not my fault if something goes wrong. This is true. Oh, can I finally shower? Please, for the love of God. Oh my God. Zack, look at this. This is it. This is what you call a shower. Any proper shower needs at least this much pressure, don't you agree? We went as far as masquerading as plumbers, all in order to experience this magical moment. Now, we're free to shower ourselves until we drown. Hooray! Still, I'm surprised that trio had the gall to use an FBI agent as a shower repairman. Those three professionals are far craftier than they let on. You noticed what they're up to, right? None of them want to be the one who calls the repairman. So they're all feigning ignorance to get me to adjust the valve instead. Such an entertaining town. <laughs> Isn't that right, Zach? Yeah. What's that that fell? Zack, it's a bead. Oh, we got a bead! Fixing the shower led us straight to a dazzling jewel. Sound like a soda can hit the floor, but okay. Okay, we got the Abyssal Bayou bead. That's... Try saying that five times fast. Abyssal Bayou bead. Abyssal Bayou bead. Abyss... Okay, maybe it's easier than I thought, but... Hooray! We finally completed that! Holy crap! I felt like I had that side quest forever. <sighs> okay. Um, so how- we don't look like we have to shave, so I think we're okay. We never have to use a bathroom. We could finally shower again. Um, let us- okay, so I'm still okay in this outfit for now. Um, now I'm trying to think what I need to do. This I have to wait till Monday. Um... I could get canned spinach at Azruli. Or Erzuli. Er, I keep saying Azruli. Erzuli Frida. I can do dogs. I can't do the dolly anymore. I can look for Danny's lost treasure. I can't do that yet. Oh, the cocktails I can do today. Um, I can find. I can do the hot spots. Okay, find find a oh. Okay. Beats value. So I collect all the five beads. So I have the abyssal one. And then I can look for all the crests. So um <laughs> what do I want to do? There's so much stuff I could do. I could try to look for Danny's lost treasure. That might be something I could do. Maybe I could do Danny's Lost Treasure. Find the memory of Galena that, da that Danny lost. When the alligator tore off his arm. Oh. But that's back on... At the house that he had his... Okay. Um... Let's just go to 
we'll go to 30. That might be a good place to start. So let me save since I completed this. It's 12.49. Yes. Okay. Let me... Go out here. And maybe we can get some new slots or something because we needed to get more items to equip like another bead or a charm or something so maybe we can finally unlock that because i've been collecting a lot of stuff i've been trying to at least okay let's head on down to honestly for two dollars and fifty cents why wouldn't you take the car So we're getting canned spinach here. Do you carry any canned goods here? Canned goods? The vermin of the grocery store? Nay, I think not. Understood, Mirror. Well then, if you'll excuse me. Wait! <laughs> Pardon? I can see it. I can see the canned good thou seeketh. How intriguing. Well then, where is the canned good I seek? In a place where no man could ever peddle it. I see. In a place where it can't be bought from a person. Got it, Mirror. Twas but a trifle. For the Lord hungers, doth he not? <laughs> it's like everyone's in on it. Zack, it's in a vending machine. Oh. It appears that God wants us to go on a wild goose chase all around town. Okay. Well, that's going to be fun. So, let me... Thou art a seeker. Let me, uh... Let's see, charms? Verily. Um, let's expand. Two necklaces? We can't do that. Can't do it. Oh, wait. Two talismans. We can do that. So I need, um, another chicory stem and a plate, I need another catfish skull, or two more, or no, I need two catfish skulls, two plates, chicory stems, uh, more beads, more alligator skin, more beads, more lizards, well no, I have lizard skin. Okay, so let's, um, let's enhance. Oh, these are the ones that I have. Dolls. Okay. So I can make them level two if I wanted to. For my stamina. That might be worth it. Plus six stamina. And then the immortal doll. I 
Actually, I should see which one I have. Um, I can see it. thou hath discovered. I should actually see which ones I have equipped before I start. Okay, so I have this one. Oh, so the E's are the ones that I have equipped. Okay, that makes sense. So I only have that one equipped. Body boost. I don't have an extra one. I can equip an incense, but I don't have any. Mini game boost. I need a talisman. So I need a talisman and an incense. Thou. Charms. Rarely. Um, create. Oh, there's incense. Okay. Uh, boost your escape. So speed, acceleration. What's the difference? But speed and acceleration were the same thing. Uh, handling, braking, durability, and speed and stuff. A bunch of stuff. Um, acceleration, handling, and durability. So that's just one for everything. Maybe make it go a little bit faster? Okay. And then I need talismans. Okay. For the mini game. So timing, um, stone luck, timing control, boat durability. Boat speed. Stone timing. I don't, oh, I bet you the mini game is um for skipping stones or yeah, skipping stones probably. Timing control. But boat durability sounds like it's for the um the gator boat tour and boat speed. So I feel like I, I don't need ones for the stone skipping. I think like I might need it for the upcoming boat thing that I'll be doing. Like that might be a better idea. Like um, boat durability or boat speed. Hmm. Well, I can't do boat speed, so I'll just do durability. There we go. Let's enhance. I can't make that better, and I can't make this better. But I can equip them. Okay. River of Destiny has been unlocked. Okay, so I unlocked a quest by doing that. So, ooh, yeah. Let's equip that. There we go. And then let's put an incent there. Okay. Very nice. So I got stuff. Um, so let's try to talk. Wait, did you just say, say shrimp? I didn't see that other part. And here I was convinced that you wanted me to collect beads. I I indubitably. Thou art to collect the five colored beads and nothing more. I shall divine thy path for thee if thou sh shall with it. What be thy wish? Um, the saint's blood bead. Uh, what, what you gonna tell me? Ta-da! If thou seekest the saint's blood bead, thou wouldst do well. Heed the request of the pourer of the fire water. Va. Okay, I want charms. Yeah, and I want to enhance the charms. So, let's boost my accuracy, my range, my firing speed, chamber size. I don't even have enough for that. Reload speed, the range. Range might be good. 
we'll just increase that for now. And then I have stamina, which I don't have enough for. That's for life. Stamina. My max speed. Okay, so I need to get more stuff. Fucking thou hath. Okay. Well, at least I got some things while I was here. That's worth it. Okay. So let us. We can't save. There's no save point here. Awesome. Great. So now I gotta look. We gotta check out vending machines. Which are marked like this. Okay, so there's one, there's two, there's three, and there's four, five. There's so many of them. There's a lot. There is a lot, a lot. So I think we're going to check this one, then that one, and then... Maybe while we're over here, we can unlock stuff. Maybe when we're over here, we can unlock stuff along the way. And then I'll start using fast travel to check the others. So let's just do that and go right. Oh, I have a board durability now, I just realized. Ooh, I am going really fast now. Um... Let's go this way. Damn, that's helpful. I definitely want to increase the speed on this thing. Oof. So we have to look for spinach. Where is it? Oh, I passed it. Okay, so we have to be in the food vending machine. Oh! Really? Really? Is it just available on all of them? I find that... Zack, we finally found our can of spinach. Okay. Look, Zack, even this vending machine is managed by Clarkson Food Delivery Services. But who in their right mind would sell canned goods in a vending machine in the middle of nowhere? I only hope that it's not expired. Okay. So what time is it right now? It's 11.39. Um, alright, well that was interesting. Oh, this is Avery's house. Over there. Um, hmm. I guess to just kind of waste time, since we have so much time to do things, I guess we can check out the areas from here and then over here and then see if we can get more fast travel points, because I feel like there might be one this way and this way, maybe. So that way it makes it easier to get to. Um. So yeah, we could do that. We go right, all the way down, and then to the left, and then right again. Okay. So, go right all the way down. And then to the left. I guess we'll just follow this out, see if there's any um, fast travel points or something along the way. Wait. I went the wrong way. There is a, there is a phone booth here though, so is there a fast travel point? There is not. Okay. 
so I gotta go this way? Probably not. I can. And then go right and then left again. Sorry, ma'am. Okay. So I should be on the right path now. I'm watching the grass and trees load up as I'm driving towards it. Oh, there's a, um... There's a floor... Floor to this here. Floor to this. Yep. There is. So, how do I get there? Oh. Where is the sign? There was one with a sign. There it is. Yeah, go this way. It's gotta be the right angle. Is it like over here? Is this glitched? Oh, come on. Can't be that far off. It's like right here. It's totally right here. It's totally right here. It's absolutely right here. 100%. It has to be. There's a thing here. It's a lizard tail. Why is this not... It should be showing up. Really? I think this glitched out. Alright, well, I guess we'll come back to it, but we know it's here. So, I passed Avery's house, so there was nothing here. But it is over here, so we'll just circle back, I guess try to get that later. This must be his house. Looks like a case of bad. Let's come back. Yeah, he might be working now. Um So What is this way now? I can go back to the church, where I can go out here and try, like, all the way down here in the first left, and see if I can talk to Avery to get that one quest. Yeah, he's not, uh, he's not here. Okay. Well, that being said... Now we gotta, hmm, what else can we do? It's 12.09, so I got spinach. The memory of Galena that Danny lost. Where was that location? Am I even allowed there now? I'm trying to think where it might be. Up here. It's a tower. That's the abandoned factory. The Clarksons. Ah, oh, Daniel's house. It's probably up there. 
Okay, so... I could go all the way up. And there's Raven's house. Alright, so here's what we're gonna do. So we're gonna go... Well, let's save first. So there's a save point right here. Next 1309. Yep. There we go. Okay. Let's fast travel to the abandoned factory. It's only two dollars to go across town. It's amazing. Okay. So then from here, we gotta go... You know what I'm going to do is I'm going to mark it, like, in the road. Like, there. So we got to go to the right, and then right again. A lot of construction going on. Over 50 miles! I got a $500 bonus! Nice. Maybe we can find some fast travel locations along the way. I don't know what that was, but... Go faster! Load trees and oh, there's a bridge. Load bridge, load all the things. Oh, maybe it's this one. This might be the area I'm thinking of. That's another sign area. Maybe that's why I couldn't. Uh... Aha. So there were two sign locations. Sneaky, sneaky. Hey, right, well, I got that at least. What other stuff do we have? Some random thing in the middle of nowhere. Oh, I could have got that at the food place. Um, I don't know what that is. That looks like it's at the abandoned factory. I don't know where that is. Or that. That might also be the abandoned factory. I'm not sure. There's another location. Okay, so there's there's some. That's definitely a abandoned factory. Okay. We're getting them. Slowly. I feel like it's doable. <laughs> I love how all of the telephone poles are crooked. Like, deliberately crooked. Because you know when you go in the country, that's exactly what it looks like. If this town has a symbol, it's got to be that bridge hanging over the bayou. Lift bridges are truly a rarity. Reminds me of Duluth, Minnesota. Remember what happened there? That man went to such great lengths to collect his victims' tons. You know, the one who would French kiss them every day as they slowly decompose? Ew! As I drove him to the station after his arrest. He started lecturing me on the proper way to give someone a kiss. Anyway, back to Duluth. <laughs> they have a famous lift bridge there called the Aerial Lift Bridge. The lift bridge here is the first one we've seen since then. But this one looks a lot smaller than the Aerial Lift Bridge. Its smaller size was most likely chosen due to the width of the river and the sea level of this area. The height and structure of a bridge is what determines which sort of boats can travel down the river. Normal bridges' base heights are set at a higher point so that boats can freely pass underneath them. But I imagine it would be difficult to create a bridge with a large arch here due to the river width and the sea level. That's why we're seeing all these mogul bridges such as lift bridges and draw bridges around here. As far as Louisiana goes, it appears that they've built mobile bridges over most of the bayous. Fascinating, isn't it, Zach? So many Ooh, nice. different types of bridges. I'm curious. Very nice. Woohoo. So this is it, huh? Good, I'm glad there's a fast travel point up here. So let's uh God, it's such a long driveway. Walkway rather. I'm gonna skate there because running is just 
I'm gonna lose all my stamina. Oh, hello! Hello? Hello. Am I allowed? I'm not allowed. Can I go in the back? There's a lot of guards here. Are you guys gonna interrupt me? Oh, yeah, let's see if we can find the, um, yes. The thing that we lost. Well, the thing that he lost, rather, when he got- That's a big gator, holy shit. Zack, this pool. The Clarkson children must have played here often. But look at it now. Instead of happy siblings, it's filled with monstrous gators. And look, that's a crocodile. See how its chin is shaped like a V? They may be similar to alligators, but they're far more dangerous. Daniel's regret is sitting in that crocodile's stomach, along with his right arm. Okay. So... What?! How did he just fucking get out?! Dude! Oh god. That's a big fucking gator. Oh god. Whoa! Oh, he's pissed. He is so pissed. Whoa, he's so pissed. Okay. Okay, it wasn't honestly that bad. I thought it would be worse. Oh, precious ring. A cheap ring that Galena once gave to Daniel, filled with memories of her. Okay, I thought killing that gator was going to be, like, boss level, but okay. It's a ring, Zack. This must be the source of Daniel's regret. It must remind him of some special memory with Galena. Zack, remember that movie we love? Romancing the Stone, 1984, directed by Robert Zemex. Zemexes? Zemexes? Zeme Zemeckis? I don't know. Story, music, characters, blah, blah, blah. I skipped over it. A work of art overflowing with originality that had never been seen before. After acquiring the legendary emerald, a crocodile devours the boss's hand along with the stone. And in the end, our main character, Jack, catches the crocodile, finds the stone, and becomes a millionaire. I just did the exact same thing here. I'm just like Michael Douglas. Romantic, isn't it, Zack? But we'll never be able to become millionaires like Jack did. We have a duty to return this ring to its owner, after all. Is he gonna be upset that I killed his fucking crocodile? Because I feel like all of his bodyguards didn't do jack shit to prevent me in that. Okay. You guys look like you're almost T-posing out here. Alright. So... That's fun. Um, so I'm gonna go take this back to Daniel. Alright, so let's go to the other side of town and give him his wife's ring. Found your wife's ring. You again? Talk. This is what you were looking for, right? Th that's. How did you get that? Oh, I, I shot your uh, your father-in-law's crocodile, but don't tell him. Romancing the stone. Romancing the stone. Yes, we pulled off a heroic feat just like Michael Douglas once did. Uh, okay, whatever. Anyway, let me thank you. This ring was the reason my treasure and I first met. 
but right after she was murdered, it went missing. I felt like I lost everything. I don't know what to do. This may sound rude, but it doesn't look very expensive. Yeah, but to me, it's worth more than any diamond. After growing up in that trash heap of a town, I met my treasure one night. We instantly clicked and our relationship became a special one. Then she, then she slid that ring onto my finger and said, I'm a princess and now you wear that ring. You're my prince. But what I want to know is, are you ready to become a king someday? Soon after that, I came to Lucare. I took her as my wife and became a member of the Clarkson family. I could still see it clear as day if I closed my eyes. We used to sit on that double swing out back and dream about the future. I became a king and she became a queen. And she always carried a doll around with her wherever she went. This is our princess, our sweet little princess. But now that dream's been shattered. My treasure and our princess are both dead and gone. I stood by her side the entire time, yet I couldn't do jack shit. God damn it. Hey, can you pretend like you never heard all that? <laughs> Being around you makes me get all weird like I don't know what got into me. Ooh. Here's some thanks for your trouble. Just take it. The Clarksons don't make debts. Got it? Then scram. If you stick around me too long, I'll get all weird again. Okay, so we got his lost treasure. At least we have that. Cool. I'm glad I was able to do that. So, wrong button. I want this one. Uh, so, I have to wait till Monday. I can do that. So, yeah, I can't give her her doll. Um, I can't finish that yet. Uh, seven days of cocktails. Hot spot of you to remember. Oh. Okay. So I can go do the, the fleur de lis. The blooming crest is finding them all. So I have to go to the hot spot. So I have to find it there. Maybe that's why I went there and I just couldn't freaking see it. That makes sense. Okay, so I have to go back to Casa. Nope. Nope. Yes. I have to go back there. Okay, so now I gotta go inside. Okay. Um. Isn't there, there's a save point over here, I believe. Yeah, let me save real quick. Since I just completed. Oh, no, I made another, ah, oh, goddammit, whatever. Guess I'll take it. Um, let's go to the hot spot. Hey boss, I highly recommend. If you're curious, sure. How's the investigation coming? Must be going well if you're on the case. Mm-hmm. Uh, recommend. Yorkie, the hot spot, right? You really want to go back there? Yes. Because I apparently missed something. We're here, Yorkie. Get out there and enjoy yourself. But I don't want to wait forever. Okay. Yeah, because I don't think I did this. Like, br brought this up to find it. Yeah, this is... Okay. So there's gotta be... Oop, oop, oop. 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 Is it over here? Maybe? Yep. There it is. That's what I was missing. 
there we go. That's all I needed. Oh, 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 oh. Did you enjoy the hot spot, Yorkie? Yes, it was far more stimulating than I anticipated. I even made a discovery. Really now? Awesome. By the way, you can only request to go to a hot spot from the transportation desk. Why? Because I've got a back scratching relationship going on with them. I'm putting everything I have on the line to make sure this wyvern business ends up as a success. So I need to throw all I can at the wall and see if it sticks. Once I'm ready to take you to once I'm ready to take you to the next hot spot, I'll let that old bellboy know and you'll be free to request it. Here's a little thanks for being my good little tester. Ooh. Nice. Wyvern, the new cutting edge transportation service will come to you wherever you are. Bye now. A back scratching relationship sack. Even in this peaceful-looking town, negotiations, politics, and ambitions run rampant. Perhaps the kind of back-scratching relationship she speaks of can only be truly realized in the country these days. A powerful reminder of how deep down all humans are shrewd, calculating creatures. Okay. So we finally got that. Nice. And we got a bonus for finding another thing. Um, okay. So... I have to wait to go and do his cocktails. Um, can try to find the beads. And then... If I find all of them, I can go back to Lewis in the graveyard, so... I wonder if there's a way to find all the beads. I'm not sure. I'll have to look that up. Okay, so for the beads... I just had to look it up because I wasn't sure exactly where the others are. I have one of them. I have the Abyssal one. And it seems like I can get another bead is if I complete killing 30 dogs. So I need to go find a place um, to kill the dogs. So... Hmm. I need to go find dogs. Where are dogs? They seem to be like in... Well, this is, this is all bees, I believe, because we were running around here for bees. Uh, I think there were dogs on this side, perhaps? So let's go here. Um, it's three... Yeah, three. Yeah, technically it's... it's no, it's 114. Yeah, military time. I'm not good. Uh, so yeah, let's go over here. Or no, there's some dogs right here. Like in this area. So we can kill some dogs. And then we can get another bead. there were dogs around here. If not here, then it was close to here. Try to find some. Wish we could take that car that's just sitting there. some dogs. Let's kill some dogs. Okay. All 
right, there's more over here. Got to reload. <clears throat> Killed them. Well, they're pretty easy to kill now. My range does need to be improved. Okay. More dogs. There's one. There we go. More dogs? Or am I just gonna find bees now? Seems like dog territory. Oh god. It doesn't seem like they mix up the dogs and the bees. I could be wrong. It might make a fool out of me. I'm not sure. Ooh, the black ones take a little bit longer. There we go. Any more dogs? Seem to just respawn magically. How many do I have? 19. Okay, so 11 more and we should be good. So if we hang around here, they should respawn back like they are right now. So there's... Eleven. Um, not finding any more. I don't know the rate at which they respawn, but it is very slow, apparently. Come on, there's all this wide open area for dogs. Do I have to go find another dog spot? Is there dog spots over here? It does not look like there's any dog spots here. Dogs. Not finding dogs. Hmm. Is there some dogs over here? Possibly. Possible dogs? Is this the area over here that has dogs? Yes. Okay. There's a couple dogs here. There we go. Um... Maybe if I head down that way, there'll be more dogs. Maybe. Oh, there's some dogs. Ok. 
Okay. There we go. Gotta be close. Now I bet if I go back to the other area... Oh, wait, there's... Some enemies showing up on my radar here. Oh, more dogs. Black dogs. Good to take a couple shots. There we go. Nope. Get the off. Okay. I wanted to pick this up, and instead I ended up riding my skateboard. Okay. There we go. Get that. Get that. Reload. All right. So I guess we'll just head back. The other places should have the enemies that respond, hopefully. It seems like it, it they do respond, but at a slow rate, so. I just pay attention to the map as long as it doesn't glitch out on me. This way. I have a feeling it might be a gator. It's a gator. We'll shoot it. For reasons. Damn, dude. No, don't skateboard into the thing. I keep hitting Y to run, and I don't know why I keep doing that, but I do. So, hmm. So over here was where more dogs were, and I shot them all. Let's see if any of them respond. Now I'll get my skateboard out. It does not look like they're responding. about back here? Are there any dogs back here? Do I have to drive around until I find some dogs? Oh, uh, 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 uh. There was something popping up on radar back here, but I don't know if it was a dog or a squirrel or something else. Where was it? Back here. Maybe more dogs? Yep, more dogs. Okay. Okay. One's dead. Dead. There we go. I had to reload for a second. That's kind of sucked. I gotta be close. Tried. I gotta pick up the rest of the stuff that I missed. There's a lot of stuff out here. Holy crap. There's that. A lot of little items here and there. Some under this tree, it looks like. One 
across the way here. You're in my way. Thank you. <laughs> Where was this? Oh, the dumpster. Is there anything else? Yeah, there's more stuff this way. Is it in people's backyards or is it like I think it's in people's backyards. It seems like a lot of this stuff respawns every day because I swear to god I picked up all this stuff over here before. <laughs> Another travel bonus for all the miles. This one's on the opposite side. There we go. And then this one. I don't know where it is. Um, one's probably in here. Yep. And then the other one's probably in the back on the porch. Besides the porch. Okay. So, I have to be close. Ah, uh, let's see. Yeah, I gotta go back. So I gotta go left and then right. car. Eh. Damn, that actually damaged my skateboard. That's not cool. Okay. Dogs. Where you be, dogs? over here. They're not responding at all. Why? Oh, I'm going like way down. I gotta turn around. Dogs pop up from here to there. Hmm. Not seeing any. at all. Look, I think this is Melvin's house. And I'm not seeing any dogs. At all. Where the fuck can I get more dogs? Oh, there's a thing up in the sky. Hmm. seems to be like the general area for dogs. Oh, you know where I could go for dogs? Up by the farm. There are a lot of dogs up there. But that means I have to go back to here to fast travel to there. So maybe I'll go do that. Am I going the 
right way? Nope, I'm not. I gotta turn around. Oh, come on. Hitting that one little part put me down 1%. That's bullshit. Right up here. All right. So take me there so I can go kill some dogs. some dogs. There's a lot of dogs here, so. Should be able to hit my quota pretty quickly. Ooh, these are black dogs. Can I miss? I can miss a hundred times. Damn. I'm gonna need to get more bullets. Okay, this dog should take two shots. Yep. So the brown dogs are much easier to kill, and so are the whites. The black dogs, though, they take like four hits. Two. Wait, two. Three. Four. Yep. Four hits. I gotta be close, dude. Let's reload. One, two, three, four. Yep. There we go. How many? Oh. I can just go. Okay. Let's go and turn that into Melvin. Never run there. It's too long to run. Okay. Let's. Oh, he's down by the river. Well, we'll come back. We're gonna go to this first. Go turn this quest in. Whoa! That was a little, uh, laggy there for a second. Alrighty. What's the buzz, Mr. FBI? Talk. Mr. York, you took care of all the mad dogs. Stupendous. Do allow me to thank you on behalf of the town. Anywho, uh, about your bounty. I happened to find this beautiful bead in town the other day. I think I'll just give it to you. Nice. So I have two beads. Two out of five. What do you think? I don't know how valuable it is, but it sure is pretty. I've never seen a bead this blue before, so I've been saying. It came from the ocean depths. Deep ocean bead. This D.O.B. was my treasure, but I'm giving it to you as proof that we're true friends. Wait, Melvin. Nah, nah, just go on and take it. You sure did me right here, Mr. York. Boy, do I owe you. Big time, mm-hmm. Cool. So we completed that, and we got the deep ocean bead. Alright, so now what's left... Um... I have to see what else we have, because we need three other beads. We got the deep ocean, we got the abyssal. Um... The saint's blood bead... 
we have to complete... Uh, so we're not going to be able to get all of this because it looks like we have to complete the cocktails one. Yeah, so there's there's a lot that we have to complete here. It's basically like you complete all the ones in the game and then you can get it. Then we got to talk to Avery. Okay, so we've we've completed quite a bit this run and I think this is where we're going to leave it for next time. So... Yes. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And next time, uh, we will continue on trying to get as much side quest stuff as we possibly can. Maybe get some cocktails. Uh, try to get all of the fleur, fleur de lis, however you pronounce it, spots, the little photo op spots with the symbol. And uh, yeah, so take care, everyone. Hope you enjoyed this. Stay safe. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.